guys welcome back to my channel i hope you are all doing great today we are going to see one more lead code problem the difficulty level is medium problem number 707 design a link to list let's see this problem in a diagram for a better understanding as a part of this problem we need to design a link to list it can be either singly link to list or double link to list If you take any linked list, how the data will be stored? Data will be stored in the form of a node, right? Especially if you take the single linked list, so it's going to have two attributes. One is val, another one is pointer. This val represents the current node value. This pointer references to the next node. It can be either a null or else any valid node. Okay. What are the basic operations of a single linked list? Basic operations. Uh, one is insertion and then deletion and then search right if you take insertion what are the different variants we have we can add a noted head we can add a noted tail we can add a node at a index position and if you take deletion we can delete delete at index and for search also same search at index so basically we are going to perform this five operations as a part of this problem so that we can tell we design a single link list by our own okay let's jump into the coding part uh yeah let me start coding for a better readability purpose i am going to take a class called a node which is going to hold these two attributes one is int val another one is node next this next is pointer to the next node okay i am going to have a parameterized constructor which is going to take a val and this is helpful for us when we try to create a node okay this dot val equal to val yes we are done with this the next thing is my link list initializes a my link list object so this is not a what i can say mandatory thing since we are taking the node so we can initialize the node object when they are trying to call this constructor by creating an object something like this okay from the driver code uh, i am going to take a variable called size let me tell you the significance of this variable okay initially it is going to be zero because my link list is empty okay as soon as i perform the operations uh, such like add or else delete i going to do the increment or else decrement of this size variable so that i can know okay how many nodes are there in my link list okay assume like first time performing uh, added head operation okay this is nothing but adding a new node to the link list then size will become 1 okay then i performed something called added tail this is also uh, addition to the link list right then size will become 2 then again i performed added index this is also an addition node to the link list then size will become 3 and then i performed deleted node deleted index i mean to say then this is a deletion of a node from a linked list then size is going to be decremented by 1 if you carefully observe the significance of size variable here so every time it help us to know how many actual nodes are there in the linked list right this is very helpful when you are going to perform especially added index and added uh, sorry deleted index okay i am going to take the same thing here int size okay and i am going to take a reference for this dummy node a node so on the calling of this one i am going to initialize the node okay dummy node equal to new node minus 1 why i am creating this because this will help us to solve a lot of corner cases 
and the minus 1 I am taking because the node value range is from 0 to 1000 only. So I can take any other value. Okay. Then initially the size is going to be 0. Done. We are pretty much good with this basic stuff now. Let's perform the operations. Uh, the first is integrate. It is going to take a index as a parameter and we need to return the value of index the node in the linked list. If index is invalid, just return minus 1. How you can tell index is invalid? It's simple, right? If index is greater than or equal to size, then simply return return minus 1. Okay? Otherwise, just take a reference of take a reference called cur node and points to the dummy node okay and iterate through your linked list okay int i equals 0 i less than size i less than or equal to index because we need to return the index the node i plus plus so every time just move ahead cur node equal to cur node dot next and at the end, just return the curve node dot val. Because you are starting from 0 and you are going till the index, okay, then at the end you are going to be at that particular index position, right? Just return that uh, value where you are currently at. That's all about the get, okay? Then we have added head, which is uh, going to take a val as a parameter and we need to add a val before the first element of the linked list. Okay, and after this insertion, that new node will become the first node. Okay, uh, for that first we need to create a node. Okay, node node equal to new node of whatever value we are getting here. And we want to make it to the first node. Right, for that what we can do? Node dot next is going to be dummy node dot next. Right, then dummy node dot next is going to be node last increment is size let me explain this uh, two steps assume we have a link list something like this minus one seven two okay and i want to insert this four at the end then what we wrote here first we are creating a brand new node that's fine. Then node dot next is going to be dummy node dot next. Okay. Dummy node always points to this one, right? Node dot next is going to be dummy node dot next. What is dummy node dot next? Seven, right? Then force next is going to be seven, and it's next to next going to be two. Okay, that is the one line. Then what we are going to do next? Dummy node dot next is nothing but node. So dummy node is at the minus one right then minus one next is going to be four then it is going to be something like this okay with this we can confirm we added a node at head okay and don't include minus one as a head this we took to cover the some formal cases this is not the valid node as part of this particular problem okay yeah we are pretty much done with this operation also then add a tail Add a tail is something like we need to add it last. Okay. What is this? It is going to give a, a this method is going to take a val as a parameter and we need to append a node of val at the last element. Great. <coughs> so for that, what you can do is you can first create a node, right? Node of val. Then take a reference of dummy node. for int i equals 0 i less than size okay and i plus plus because i want to insert at last right that means i need to go till the size okay cur node equal to cur node dot next and after completing this uh, loop so i can assure i am going to be at the last node in the linked list right then I need to insert my newly created node at last. So, kernode.next is going to be node. This is an insertion. Then you need to increment this value by 1. 
yes we are pretty much done with this operation also then add it index this is simple okay same like about to uh, it is going to have the two parameters index and val and we need to add value before the index and uh, remember before the index not at the index in order okay and if it index equals to the length of the linked list then we need to append at the end of the linked list if it is greater than we need to we will going to do nothing simply have a if condition something like if index is greater than size okay just do nothing okay otherwise create a node first node node equal to new node of var great and take a reference of dummy node dummy node okay then i need to in insert before the index right for that what i need to do i need to iterate before the index position right for i co int equal to 0 i less than index and i plus plus okay and till that moment just keep on moving forward for node dot next and once you are at the what i can say index before position then what you need to do just simply do something called node dot next is equals to take kernel dot next then kernel dot next is going to be node then you need to increase the size okay we are done with this operation also then we have the only final that is deleted index deleted index is nothing but we need to delete the index the node from the linked list okay and as usual we need to know if it is a valid or it's not if index is greater than or equal to size simply do nothing otherwise just keep on moving forward for int i equal 0 i less than or equal to index and here we need to delete the i index the node okay that's the reason we need to go till the index then i plus plus car node equal to car node dot next sorry we no need to go till the index we need to go before the index because we need to return uh, delete the index one right for that you just need to do something like this car node dot next is equals to car node dot next dot next then since this is a deletion operation just do a size minus minus so that's all, this all operations, let me run it. Uh, yeah, there should not be space. Where is it? Size. Yes. It got accepted and let me submit it. Yes, this got submitted. And I hope you learned something new today. Thanks for watching my video. Please do subscribe and have a great day.